Well, believe it or not, we have a piece of space junk that's been labeled WTF that is heading straight for Earth, and it is due to crash into Earth in less than a month. Now, what is very odd about this is that they're claiming that no one knows exactly what this object is, hence the name WTF, and this is for real. But they have no doubt about it that it is going to crash into Earth, and they're saying that it's hollow inside, meaning it might be man-made. Okay, that's the verbiage here on Yahoo. They're saying it's about two meters wide and is hurtling toward Earth and is set to impact in the Indian Ocean of all places. Now, what is also interesting to note about this, it does have some numbers associated with it, and it has 911 in it backwards, 0911. So this WTF object, cylindrical in shape, making its way in, will re-enter the atmosphere at roughly 2.20 p.m. on November 14th. They're saying most of it should burn up. But how do they know that if they don't even have a clue of what it's made of, is my thing. They're saying that any leftover debris will make sea fall about 40 miles off the coast of Sri Lanka. So anyone in the area of Sri Lanka that can hear my voice that may be outside or looking up at the sky on November 14th around 2.20 p.m., heads up for, whatever, for whatever's coming in. I'd love to see some footage, get to the bottom of exactly what this is. And they're saying that they think it's man-made in all this speculation because they have no proof. They're saying that it could be from some ancient rocket or some long lost mission that they just left up there and there is a lot of debris but normally they would have these pieces classified and tracked and in all that you never know all i'm saying is they're saying they're not sure what it is they think it's man-made and it's going to impact earth november 14th so we'll have to sit back see what happens i'm sure that this isn't going to be some catastrophic event okay but if it doesn't break apart and impacts the ocean it would cause at least a minor tsunami wave if it did not break apart and you have no idea what it is what, what kind of materials in there if anything's radioactive i mean just doesn't make a whole lot of sense to me that they have no clue whatsoever and they're saying that it may be man-made just seems like they would know and with the cameras they have out there and the technology they have out there, it just strikes me as odd they're labeling this WTF and keeping it all mysterious till impact time. So for what it's worth, wanted to share it with you. Also, do not think it's a coincidence. They've got the 9-11 ticker taped in there. I'll leave links. Keep you guys posted as I get updates. It's been Dabu7. Eyes to the skies.